Today, I bring you GameStop. This is the GameStop. Still slightly in progress because we make changes here and there, but you've got all kinds of words and signs and open and all that. So at least we know they are open for business. So we will be able to get our stuff today. Got a cool HVAC unit on top. This one's a little unique from our sets, as you can see if you watch the previous uh, rough video. This is completely different. We try to change things up as much as we can. And this one here is slightly bigger and there's no piping on the roof. So maybe this building is a little more efficient. Let's take a look at the front first, because I like this view. It gives it kind of the uh, 3D as you look in the windows. And um, it also makes it look like the lights are on. So as you start walking in, the Fortnite and whatever that is above it. I'm not really sure. But Fortnite's pretty popular right now, so there you go. Some Fortnite Call of Duty there in the back. That, of course, is going through the front. Let's go in even further. All right, over to your left, you've got the Wii wall and a couple screens depicting the uh, actual games, the gameplay in progress. Probably some uh, product information being played on those as well. The Nintendo Switch section. Want a Nintendo Switch game? There you go. Best place to get it. Okay, so we'll call that the West Wall. The West Wall has the Wii and the Nintendo Switch. The Back Wall, my absolute favorite wall. PlayStation, I see all kinds of cool games. Fortnite, Call of Duty, gosh, Tetris. Well, goes on and on. More monitors. Oh, GameStop has Xbox. What do we got? Let's see. Minecraft, Batman, Far Cry, and of course, more monitors. So, let's spin this all the way around, which is not going to be easy, and show you the front. What's, oh, okay, so you can actually play the Nintendo Switch right there. Awesome. Love it. And, oh, hey. There's a back section to all of that. Looking, we got Hitman, Grid, Just Cause. Wow, great games, love them. Okay, so you picked out all your games and you're thinking, oh man, you know what? I don't have a console and I don't have remotes. So what do you do? You go to the counter and you get hooked up with a console and remotes. And there you go, consoles galore. Xbox, what's that, Switch, PlayStation 4, and the Wii. And above that, all kinds of remotes. Everything you need to be an awesome gamer. And you've got Daryl working the desk in front of all of his GameStop registers. Because you know what? As I always say, you need registers to run a business and make money. Hey, what's on the back of that? Let's see, Spider-Man, X-Men. Got all the games covered in this one. And then um, TV over there. I guess, uh, I guess Daryl's gotta have something to watch, right? And okay. right there, you've got it, folks. The Brick Addicts Game Stop. In all of its oh, glory. Everything you could possibly need to be the best gamer in the world. All in one place. There we go. We'll put the roof back on, kinda. We will shut the door so we don't let the AC out. And there you have it. So, who knows what the design team, using all of these millions and millions of parts 
might come up with next. Because kids, adults, all of you, it all starts right here. Pieces and what you do with them. Thank you all for watching today. We absolutely love each and every one of you. Be sure to click down there and subscribe. If you like the video, if you like game stuff, if you like cars, if you like Daryl, be sure to click that like button. Be sure to click the bell for notifications. And we will see you in the next video. Thank you all so very much.